Yo, Darius Britt here. So today we're covering five things that you can do to improve your filmmaking skills. So these aren't in any particular order, but number one would be taking acting classes. This is going to give you a sense of the acting process and you're going to learn about the acting lingo. And these two tools are going to make you a much better communicator when it comes to talking with your actors and getting what you need out of them. Oftentimes you're asking things of your actors, but you don't really know what it's like to be on the other side of the camera and what you're actually asking of them. So by being on the other side of the camera and performing yourself, You'll thus know what it's like to be an actor and you'll thus understand their predicament a little bit better and it's going to make you again a much better communicator. This is a great way to meet new talent. You'll meet and work with new actors that you might work with in the future and you guys will already have a working relationship and kind of understand how each other works. And number two, watch Inside the Actor's Studio. The episodes aren't very long and it is a great resource to learn about acting. You can pretty much find all the episodes online for free and if you watched one video every day for a month, you would learn so much about acting. I promise you, if you are not comfortable directing actors now, if you watched Inside the Actor's Studio every day, one episode for a month, by the end of that month, you feel like you can direct anybody. And number three, Watch your favorite films with the sound off. By doing this, this allows you to focus on just the visuals. You'll be surprised at how much more you pick up with the sound off and you just watching the visuals. Everything feels different. Watch how they move the camera. How does it affect the narrative? How does it make you feel as an audience member? How does it affect the pacing of the story? Watch five of your favorite films with the sound off at least twice and just really study the camera movements and I guarantee you, you will learn a lot. And number four, shoot as often as possible. If you want to get better at directing actors, the best way to get better at directing actors is to direct actors. Grab a couple friends, script out a scene, and shoot it. Don't worry about lighting it, don't worry about making it look pretty, just focus on working with actors. Don't dump any resources into these scene studies, just shoot them for free, you don't have to upload them anywhere. You just shoot it, work with the actors, cut it up, learn your lessons, and then delete it if you want. You want to get better at working on your visual effects? Perform VFX tests, just practice, practice, practice. Stay prolific, stay busy, stay at it. And number five, watch a lot of movies. And I don't mean watch a lot of movies, I mean watch a lot of movies. Watch movies until you're sick of watching them and then watch some more. On the face of it, it seems easy, but you'll be surprised at how quickly you get sick of watching movies after a certain point. The more you watch, the more familiar you'll be with storytelling, the more you'll see certain trends and cliches, you'll see things done well, things done not so well, but you'll have all of this experience to reflect on when you're making your own movies, thus making you a better filmmaker. And if you have any time after that, actually break down the movies that you watch, as in watch them repeatedly. Study the ones that you found were good, break them down to figure out why they're so good, and study the ones that are bad, break them down to figure out why they're so bad. It's no coincidence that usually the best filmmakers tend to be cinephiles as in you know Tarantino, Martin Scorsese, Steven Spielberg, they've seen so many movies that they have such a, an archival knowledge of films that they can't help but make better movies. So the moral of the story, watch a crap ton of movies until you vomit and then watch more. Well that's all I got for you. If you enjoyed what you saw please like or subscribe. If you got any questions or comments please leave them in the comment section below or you can you know hit me up on Facebook or Twitter. Bam there's some links for you and uh, yeah that's all I got. Deeper it out. Yo, Darius Pritt here. So today we're talking about listening. One of the most important things that you should always ensure that your actors are doing is listening to one another. When actors are listening to one another, they're doing more than just hearing.